So our business is, is centred around the consultancy side of the MACE business um, and our service is very much in and around anything from secure construction to pure consultancy services to integrated project delivery. We act as a delivery partner for Defence Primes, we work very closely with MOD and wider government and we have broad ranging commissions that um, relate to services such as strategic advisory, commercial consultancy and overall project um, programme delivery. Really diverse, really exciting um, range of projects that we have. What I've enjoyed about working with MACE is um, the opportunities that it's present me. Um, it's used my core military skills and put me back in a military environment which is an environment I understand um, and have spent years in. But it's also allowed me to bring the business skills that I have um, to a slightly different environment and context. What I like about working for MACE is the support network that um, MACE affords. Um, there's a degree of flexibility of where you are placed as well, um, so it really can kind of pull your skill set into, um, into the client. I really like working for MACE because it's the people, the ambition and the style. MACE is unique because it provides an end-to-end -end service for its clients from concept to design to construct to operate and nobody else does that. I think the thing that attracted me to the defence sector is the, uh, is the multitude of different sectors so one minute I could be in land, air, sea, next thing I could be doing electronic, cyber, electronic, uh, cyber security and I think the overall opportunities that are available to gain experience from is I think the thing that attracted me the most to the defence sector. Mace is a fantastic employer, uh, they're really inclusive which is you know, a real drive for me, especially the military network uh, which I discovered after joining Mace, uh, who will really support all uh, service leavers and reservists like myself. I think as a business we're good at challenging ourselves to be better and to improve what we're doing day in day out, we challenge ourselves, we challenge our clients in pursuit of a better way we're always looking for how we can push the boundaries and, and we certainly do that in defence. MACE was recommended to me by an ex-military colleague um, and they pulled out um, the Mil MACE military network which I've become involved in and the fact that MACE um, has worked to achieve the gold standard in the military covenant. So um, the MACE military network is an informal grouping of ex-military people within MACE that help each other um, in the day-to-day -day working environment, they offer advice uh, a little bit of mentorship, a little bit of leadership when required, but they also help people transitioning from the military into um, the commercial and the, the business world. What attracted me to MACE is that they're a leading consultancy and a trusted delivery partner into the defence sector. I guess it's reassurance and confidence to clients that we are bringing people from the defence industry into our defence sector. They have knowledge of the trials and the challenges that our clients are facing and we are learning and sharing those ideas and will come and really test their ambitions about what they want to succeed. So I think what I enjoy the most about my job is the flexibility of the, um, of the various opportunities which I'm given. So I'm, not, I'm never really tied down to one industry, to one sector. I can, every six months I can pick and choose and try my hands at a new domain and I, I think that's, um, it's good for trying to broaden your experience and overall learning in the defence sector. Um, my proudest moment at MACE so far is definitely seeing the flag raised at the new Defence Infrastructure Organisation's headquarters in Litchfield. Um, while I wasn't there, it was a virtual ceremony, it still uh, was really fantastic to see my sort of first project with MACE complete and the client happy with the results.